Okay, my people, welcome back. Now, for a few days now, we have been hearing from different sectors of um, the country, Nigeria, that uh, Mazen Namdekanu, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, should be released. <laughs> and um, everybody don't they say, ah, thank God, do, thank God, do, say, um, the move has been ignited. Even the Southeast governors came together and said, okay, well, let's go and meet the AGF and the president. The PDP caucus led by Enine Abaribe also met with the AGF to deliver a message to the president, Ebola Ahmed Tinubu, plus other Igbo people and even about 50 senators, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, the other day, went also met with uh, uh, the government of Nigeria. Even our brother, what did they call Agwacha, White Lion, he still go meet the former president of the country, what did they call uh, Muhammad Mbuare, to release the help in releasing Mazen Namdekano, whom he could not release when he was the president of the country. I can't begin to ask this simple question. I say, now, now, when it don't come up for Chichen, I won't come release him. Hmm. The release of Mazen Namdekano is there in the hands of God because these people, the way they say they do something, me and Ogbadu, yes, Kogbadu, 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 any Kogbadu. I know but do the thing within they do. Uh -huh. So as we they proceed, so we be say people mind don't come down and say, oh, in few days' time, in few weeks' time, they go down conclude and the release of Mazen Nam the Kano. Now we come here another news. I say waiting be that. Wanna see waiting at the C for screen now. Now some Igbo politicians secretly met Southeast governors to stop on Nam the Kano's release. <laughs> Well, I do. Now, if you be now, you can't tell us this one. Say, hmm, make I see what in the they see you. Say, some Igbo politicians say they don't still go back, go go pinch the Southeast governors, these people here, that they should not release Maze Namdekano. I beg my people, make you tell me what you know the reason. Follow this matter. Some Igbo politicians secretly met with Southeast governors to stop on Namdekano's release. Now, this is coming from the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB. And they say that there are some politicians from the Southeast who are making frantic, frantic effort to frustrate the release of each detained leader, Mazen Namdekano. IPOB, in a statement issued by its media and publicity secretary, Emma Powerful, said that its M branch revealed that some politicians visited the Abia state governor, Governor Alex Oti to persuade him not to support the quest for Kano's release from the Department of State Services DSS custody in Abuja. A man powerful said, we wish to inform those criminal elements working against the release of Nam de Kano to beware because we know of their secret meetings and discussions against Kano. If they continue with their sabotage, their names will be made public soon. Also, some of the Igbo, some of the political jobbers in the Southeast region working against the unconditional release of Unam de Kano should know that we are following the activities closely. IPOB, now they tell us this one, who say they, they follow them bumper to bumper, say they know they give them space, who say, may they know, say they, they, they are back, say if they do anyhow, they will see anyhow. Hmm. Well, I do. The unscrupulous individuals hold secret meetings with Southeast governors to frustrate the clarion call of the release of Nam de Kano, who incidentally is the only political prisoner in Nigeria currently. We want those sabotaging the unconditional release of our leader to stop that they should know that nothing happens in the Southeast region without IPOB getting the intel ahead of time. Those Igbos involved in the dastardly act to frustrate the release of Kano should retrace their steps quickly. Emma Powerful said that Kano has not committed any crime known to law internationally or locally, noting that he has been in detention illegally for more than three years now. Namde Kano's continuous detention is a gross violation of our peer court's judgment and a slap on Ndibo's face as a race. The unscrupulous politicians from the Southeast region sabotaging the release of Kano are also not regarded. The unscrupulous Igbo persons working against the unconditional release of Kano are not only working against Nam the Kano but also sabotaging Ndibo as a whole. Now, waiting IPO become a contender to say, hmm, 
bad belly people don't enter inside this matter see they don't carry hand they don't carry sand go pour inside the gary when the southeast governors and the other politicians they prepare to take feed the president and the agf may they for the release Mazi Namdekano. Now on top of that one, now we see this uh, um, Ayo, former governor, Ayo Fayoshi brother. When he come out, he say he's lending his voice also um, to call for the release of Mazi Namdekano after Pito be made the same appeal. Now Muna, watch the video. I am joining His Excellency, former governor of Anambra, Mr. Peter Obi to call for the release of Unamdi Kanu. Unamdi Kanu has been there for a while now and he has gotten bail from courts, different courts, and he was never released. I was thinking as soon as uh, our president, His Excellency, President Bola Met Numbu came in, I thought he will extend that only branch to Kano Unamdi. I mean, if we look at other people from the north, they were given amnesty. They did worse than him. And I believe if they release Kano Unamdi, there will be peace in the southeast. There will be a lot of peace. You'll be able to control the boys. Because if you see all the crimes that are going on in the southeast, they are saying it's because their leader is in detention. I believe that's a smart way to reduce what is going on in the southeast. So I'm joining him to call for the release of Unamdi Khan. All right, I'm on. I don't hear the matter there coming from. This uh, our brother here will be um, Ayo Fire Shea's brother. Now, not just that, um, I still have another update. Before we proceed, let me not forget to inform all those people who are interested. We'll be saying, on want to money, go Nigeria. Say, opportunity, um, don't call. Um, here, uh, for you, if you want to send money, go Nigeria, may you use Tap Tap Send. And the better app when you feel use, take Send Money, go Nigeria. And uh, if you use my promo code, will be critics news. They will give you extra money on top of the money when they send. They will give you five pounds, five euro, ten ten dollars, twenty five AED for those when they for Dubai. So no miss out in this promo. Even if you they use another app, may you try this one to really collect this money. Now the only way we will take the appreciate the people will be said and they follow us for this platform. Even if you don't use them before. Still inform another person, make it the user. So, moon as share. May this may we may we finish their money. No, you both company, you both finish their money. <laughs> you understand? By the time they go share this money to 1,000 people, my people, hmm, we go don't make a better money without to. <laughs> it is that play play. Eh, only me no feature up. I'm not even make a carry the update come out. So, I beg go, and I don't hear that one. Um, as we they proceed, make I play on this video here. Um, where they say our brother, where they recall Harris and Bamnishu, say don't recover money when some police officers rob from one uh, person furniture. See the money, now be this one. Money is 500,000. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. It's complete. Yeah, yeah, this money and I'm going to give it to the owner. On Adosiam, now Harris I really like waiting Harris and uh, they do go go bless them. Eh? They are at uh, okay, no three friends. She married she some and she uh, we are in a three circle somewhere in our nature going to buy phone and accessories where they were arrested by police officers from CPS or nature. They bundled them inside their patrol vehicle and took them to their station. And now from there, na 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 now they for collect this money from them. Imagine police police officers. Robbery, nine daylight robbery, nine be this one. So, I beg this nonsense has to stop. Nigerian police, I beg, make gonna help me they share our video so that they go they see and say we they see their evil, and with that, they can stop. But if we they shout, nobody they hear them, they will say, Now play play now, we did until it happened to you, then you understand.
Thank you and God bless you.